Hey YouTube, this is Discharge Media, and I'm going to show you how to install dev files onto your iPhone or iPod Touch using iFunbox and a dev file. Now, um, what you're going to need is iFunbox. Um, if you followed my early tutorial um, on how to convert these zip files into IPAs, you'll already have this. But if you didn't, there's a link in the description for the iFunbox website. You're going to download it, extract it to your desktop, and then you'll have it. Uh, I'm going to be dealing with byte sms deb. So what you're going to do first is you're going to open iFunbox. It's going to try to find your uh, device. Double click your device. You're going to click on raw file system. Click on private. Var. And then mobile. Not mobile device, but mobile. Okay. Now you're going to copy the deb file into this folder, into this folder right here. So you're just going to copy it in there, right there. Now it's in there. And now you're going to scroll up, and you're going to save removal your device. So everything should go away. And now you can unclip your thing, your device from the computer. And now I'm going to go to my iTouch. Alright, so the first thing you need to do is, well, you're going to need Terminal. And it's a app in the uh, Cydia. So what you're going to have to do, is you're going to have to go to Cydia. And you're going to have to search for Mobile Terminal. And you're going to have to download this app right here. Once you download it, you're gonna, it's going to respring. You're going to click on the app. And then what you're going to need to do... You're going to have to type in SU root. It's going to ask you for a password. You're going to type in Alpine, A L P I N E. Next, I'm going to, every time I click next, you're pretty much clicking enter or return. Um, I accidentally did it wrong here. I, I put in, I spell Alpine wrong. So I had to do it twice password, Alpine. Okay, and then you get access to the VAR mobile root. What you're going to do is you're going to type in this right here. dpkg space dash i and then you're going to type in the name of the file my the name of the file for me was byte sms dot deb and then you're going to click return um, it's going to unpackage it and install it and then you're going to have to respring it doesn't matter how you respring I'm using sb settings to respring so you respring and then yay it's right there